Hi Mike, uh, welcome to the channel. In this video uh, I'm gonna show probably the most important thing in my opinion to do if you want to shoot tight groups. You can leave everything else but this is something that you have to do. So that was 6 6.46 um, millimeter. So basically I'm going to be tuning the 40 grain Javelin G2s. Now this and I'm also going to be shooting Inferno 40 grain Cubase. But this rifle has been tuned for I think it was 40 grain RBTs. So not one of these two slugs, not the Javelin G2s or the Inferno Cubase has been tuned for, uh, you know, the rifle has been tuned for them. So as, as we progress, I'm going to, in this case, I have um, lengthened that pellet probe to seat the bullets deeper. Three sessions. First session will be just shooting five Infernos, then five javelins, and uh, see what the group looks like. Then I'm gonna meters. adjust that pellet probe a little bit deeper. Uh, again, uh, around about five shots with each, see what the difference is. Now I know by now that um, at the specific length uh, of pellet probe, the javelins will start shooting well. So you will see. The last session uh, will be the javelins will be tuned, and of course the infernos will be uh, not, work. will not group that great because the rifle has not been tuned for them. It has been tuned for the javelins. So yes, I hope you find this interesting. Enjoy. It. And then five meter, five Inferno 40 grain cup base, and then five Javelin 40 grain Gen 2. Pressure 178.8. First shot was 181. Yes, unfortunately, I did not check the alignment on the scope cam before I started uh, shooting. So, unfortunately, the first session with this scope cam will be will have that dark, dark uh, spot there. Okay, javelins holding the same. Okay, so the pellet probe length that we've used in this session was uh, 6.46 millimeter. Not holding for wind, just shooting. Of course, this is with no particular setting. I haven't tuned for the javelins, I haven't tuned for the mock for the infernos. Okay, so the first session, not that great groups. Uh, that was at 6.46 millimeter. Now I have adjusted to 7 millimeter for, for the second session of shooting. Basically, 5, 6, 7 millimeters. This was, of course, after that first session. Okay, so this session I'm taking with the uh, Eagle Vision setup number two. I've turned the 
pallet prep in 110. Starting again with Inferno. Let me zoom out a bit. Yes, that was the Infernos, now the Javelin. 40 grain, Gen 2. Shooting around about 960. 9, the Javelin and the Infernos, 965. Javelin. Hmm, that. That's in the wind. Okay, so this is the beginning of the third session. Unfortunately, I did not uh, focus properly. Um, uh, the Eagle Division uh, cameras are set up in such a way, um, if I look through the scope, it should be just out of focus. Then it would be in focus if you view the footage. Unfortunately, I did not uh, set it properly. So, but anyways, third session. Javelin. This is now, of course, with a pellet probe much longer. It's, uh, I think it was 7.75. But this is on my set. So you have to play with that pellet probe length. Either longer, shorter, until you get tight groups. But anyway, third session. I did not hold for the wind, so. What do you think of that group? That went picked up. June to, to hunt now, the javelins. Another one. The wind. Wind again. And the register left. Okay, great. Ready to hunt. Okay, in the video. Thanks for watching. Um, so I hope you found this interesting. Um, pellet probe length, the most important thing to get tighter groups. I see too many people battling with, you know, the speed of the bullet and, you know, tuners and this and that, but they haven't touched the pellet uh, probe length. You know, the seating depth, very important. Uh, even bullets with the same length uh, will need different seating depths. I'll have to guess, point one. Uh, either deeper or shallower. But anyways, uh, next video will be hunting video with the uh, 40 grain G2s. Um, I've got a few uh, videos already, but far too little. So, um, yes, next video G2 hunting. Thanks for watching.